Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching. So it's been a while since I've done a what's new in my wardrobe haul. And okay, this actually unintentionally turned into a summer dresses, occasion dresses, sort of try on haul, just because I didn't realize how many new dresses I had until I did this. So if you are looking for a new summer dress, then you've come to the right place, let me tell you that. If you are ready for a color explosion and you wanna see all of the new summery outfits and things in my wardrobe, then please keep watching. I'm gonna start off with that these dresses from Rouge and Ready. I know I showed them in my vlog a couple of weeks ago, but I haven't actually tried them on for you all and I'm literally obsessed with them. This one in particular is my favorite. How amazing is the print on this? I mean, I know I've gone on about the mesh vibes in a lot of my styling hauls, but I just absolutely love that it's so in right now. This one's insane as well. It's got like all this ruching up the side. The actual material underneath is such a lovely like figure hugging fabric. You feel very like sucked in in it. It feels honestly feels amazing on. Plus this would look really cute with those pink Zara heels. These ones, the ones that I feel like I've just spoken about a lot. I wear them so much at the moment because they're so cute and they go with everything. So here is this dress on with the pink heels. I feel like it just works so perfectly with pink accessories. I also have got this little pink bag from Misguided that I thought I'd just put on over the top because as I said, pink accessories and this dress are just an absolute dream. I'm completely obsessed with this. I'm wearing this dress in a size small, but I would say if you are between sizes, maybe go a size up because it is very figure hugging, which I like because it really sucks you in. But just in case you're wondering on sort of sizing, so I thought I would just try on all of the dresses from Rouge and Ready because this one is also amazing. I had to put my hair up with this though because I feel like this neckline just looks so nice when you wear your hair up. The colours in this dress are amazing. They are so nice. Again, it's made out of that sort of like mesh material with the ruching up the side. I feel like this is also going to turn into like a little bit of a first impressions because I've got a lot of stuff here that I've been sent and I haven't had a chance to try it on. But this one, I honestly... I'm so in love. I just love the material that these are made out of. Look at the pattern on that. How amazing is that? It's so, so nice. I feel like this as well would look so nice with green heels. I had this one, it's really annoying. I know my green lace up misguided ones, which I featured in like one of my hauls a couple of weeks ago. That These would look amazing with it, but I don't actually currently have them, which is really annoying because people love to borrow my clothes, which I'm all for. It's fine. Um, but they're not in the house at the moment. But how nice would this look with like green strappy heels and like green accessories? And then lastly is this absolute dream colour. I feel like green is slowly but surely becoming my favourite colour of the summer. I know I started off living for pink, and don't get me wrong, I mean pink is still just like unbelievable, but I'm obsessed with this green colour. I think it is so, so nice. I just think it's so different, like I'm not sure about you guys, but until this year I didn't have anything that was this sort of green in my wardrobe, and now like you'll see in this haul, there's actually a lot of green in this um, video. And Lucy, who owns Roost and Ready, she really puts so much thought and like effort into her dresses because she wants everyone to feel amazing in them. So they're always just designed to, and I, whenever I wear one of her dresses, I always feel so comfortable. Um, and this one in particular, I just, oh, honestly, the color, it's amazing. I just feel like I've got so many dresses in my wardrobe now, but I need more reasons to wear them. I just basically need to tell Joe that he needs to take me on more date nights, basically. It's the only, the only answer is to just go and eat more food. So I got a couple of items from Motel Rocks, which I actually got with Lisbon in mind, but I got a lot of things with Lisbon in mind. And then obviously I couldn't wear it all. But I wanted to show you guys this one, which was a top that I didn't take with me, but I'm honestly so in love with it. I got it sort of either to wear with denim shorts like I've got on here. So these denim shorts are the Zara 90s short, which are just my favourite, I'm honestly obsessed with them. But I just loved the yellow satin of this. And I love this style of top because I feel like you could go out in the day in this and go for like more of a casual sort of look, you know, you know, whack on some sunglasses, maybe some like chunky flip flops, you know, that sort of vibe. But you can equally dress this up, which is why I think tops like this are so good when you're on holiday because you could wear this with denim shorts, but put on a pair of heels and it would look like a really dressy outfit, I think because it's satin. So I, as I said, I think it's always good when you go away to have tops that can kind of double up as day and night but I'm just gonna style this up how I'd wear it in the daytime because that's sort of what I had in mind when I got this top to wear on holiday so the shoes are the chunky mango flip-flops which I showed you guys in Lisbon and also my packing video I love these flip-flops I'm honestly genuinely 
They are the best thing I've bought in 2021. 20, I forgot you were in there. Um, which I know sounds crazy because I do buy a lot. But I have honestly lived in, in them. I wore them every single day in Lisbon. They are so comfortable. They're just the perfect holiday flip-flops. Slash also I'm wearing them in England. So yeah, I'm, I cannot rate them enough. Put on a pair of sunnies. These ones are the Veux um, sunglasses. And then you can either style it. So I'd probably either put like a little sort of like 90s style shoulder bag on. Like this which would look really cute. But then while I was away, I was actually really living for the sort of like more st sort of oversized tote bags. So I've got this one, which was from, I think this is from Naked Fashion. I feel like when you are away on holiday, you, you might want to put like loads of different things in your bags, so whether it's like beach towels or, you know, that sort of stuff. So yeah, this is sort of how I would wear it. The only thing I would say with this top is that the band that goes sort of across here is there's not like that much stretch in it. So I'm actually wearing a medium in this. And like what, well, I'm a 34D bra. So that might be able to give you guys sort of like an idea. So like I'm not like super broad across here, but I'm also not like a 32. So just maybe keep that in mind that I'm normally like a size small in tops from Motel, but this one I'm glad I got it in a medium because it doesn't really have that much stretch where it sort of does up. And then also from Motel, which I was gonna wear in Lisbon, is one of these like sort of slip dresses from there. I actually bought one of these last year in like a greeny purple pattern and I just love them for summer. I think they're such a cute dress. Again, because you can do dressed up or dressed down. And actually, I feel like as you can see here, they are great for your boobs. Like there's not many dresses that make my boobs sit like that, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I honestly put them on and I'm like, oh, hi. Um, so yeah, I actually love them and they come in so many different prints. I think they're really, really cute. So this I'm wearing in a small um, and I would say sizing of them is smaller. Um, but yeah, I, the small's fine with me and I, and as I say, I really, really love them and they're so handy. So, so handy to have on holiday. Okay, so this top is not actually that new. It's from Beginning Boutique, but the excitement is real, guys. You know the pink Storettes blazer? It now comes in like multiple colours. This one is another personal favour of mine. I'm obsessed with the colour of this. I think it is so nice. I thought I'd put this top on underneath because I actually think it works really well because it's got the sort of like turquoisey colour running through it. And I just think blue and then the blue and then the blue denim. How many more times can I try and say blue there? Bit of a blue vibe this, but how amazing is this blazer? I mean, we all know my obsession with that pink one, so you can understand my excitement when the turquoise one arrived on my doorstep. I was like, this is insane. So yeah, I absolutely love it. And I feel like even with just like a simple plain blue bralette underneath, that would also look amazing. And I do love the way that the turquoise looks with the denim. I think it's so nice. So um, yeah, if you've got the pink one, and like me, you've worn it to death, Maybe it's time to get yourself a new colour, and this one in particular is amazing. It also comes in yellow and green. Um, I'm going to try the green one on a little bit later, but I will just put the yellow one on now um, so that you guys can see what that one looks like on. But I think, I think definitely the pink and the blue are my faves, but I'll show you the yellow anyway. So this is the yellow one, and I do like it, but my only thing is with this one, but I wanted to just show you guys anyway, just in case you guys are sort of looking at the other colours, is I feel like it's a little bit too light, the fabric, so you can actually see the shoulder pad. Um, that's my only thing on this and it's a, shame, it's a shame because I actually really love the blazer but I just think it could have done with being double lined which I don't know if that's just something when you sort of make your own clothes you become more aware of these things um, but yeah that's the only thing I have on this whereas like the turquoise one, the pink one and the green which I'm going to show you are insane but I did want to show you anyway because I do love the lemon colour I think it is really nice and actually if you want it to look like a really sort of like nice lightweight summer blazer then this is definitely definitely like fine and especially because it is made out of a nice lightweight linen um but yeah i just thought i would say that um because you know me i'm always gonna be honest with the things that i try on so while we're on the yellow vibe i thought i'd just show you guys this little set so this is actually from revolve and i thought it'd be so cute actually sort of as more like a swimwear kind of beachwear cover-up because the skirt and the top themselves are really sort of like a bit like a flimsy material and i just think they would look really cute when you're away on holiday. I mean, obviously they are like a fluffy knit, so I know that seems slightly bizarre, but I just love the color of it. I think it's so cute. You can actually also adjust where the skirt sits. So you can sort of tie it up or tie it down and like increase the sort of ruching. So these next few items are from Beginning Boutique and I actually have just opened up the package. So I'm trying them on for the first time, literally right now. I'm obsessed. How nice is this dress? Oh my God. 
I want to wear this to like a wedding or something. It's got this like crisscross over back, which is just such a nice detail. And it's like, oh, how nice. And the length, as I said, I feel like that length as like a, I just feel like this sort of length for a wedding is just really nice, isn't it? I think I'm gonna have to actually wear this to, I've got a couple, actually I've got a few weddings coming up, providing that COVID doesn't do any more damage to all my special friends in their special days. Let's hope not. Anyway, um, but yeah, I love this dress. I think it's so, so nice. I mean, the color of it is probably why I'm absolutely living for it. But what do we think? I love the side detail as well. So nice. And the fact that it's backless. Basically, it's just got a bit of everything that I love. And the colour. It's also made out of a really, like, sort of like a stretchy knit. But, like, not too knitted. It's like, I don't know how to describe it. But it's really nice. It feels really nice on. This is in a size small or size 8. I can't remember. But, I'll put, as always, I'll write below what sizes I'm wearing. Um, but, yeah, I feel like we should all twin this summer. Let's all buy this dress and we can all twin because I think we all need one of these in our wardrobe. <laughs> so, this is also from Beginning Boutique in the PR gift thing that's just arrived. And I love it. I mean, the colour of it is so nice, but I just think maybe it's a little bit too cutesy for me. But I think it's unbelievable. I think if you're a bit more into that sort of, like girly i mean i am actually quite girly but there's just something about it. i think maybe it's like the little bow tie which is not maybe as much me but the shorts i think are really cute i like how they go like super a-line i feel like this is unintentionally turning into a summer dress try on haul basically um so i got this dress from zara a couple of weeks ago mainly because of the color of it i was like oh I just love how colour is such a big thing this summer. So it's got like a super drapey front, which actually, if you want to wear it really open like here, you could put on a lace bralette underneath if you're a bit worried about it being really open, or you could sort of tape it down. But I love when a dress sits like that, where it's like really open, like open slouchy shirt kind of vibe. The way that this dress looks particularly nice though is you've really got to tie the ties like super, super tight. It was really funny. I feel like this was such a Zara moment because... I actually saw this dress online and I was like, oh, that has potential to actually be so nice. But I was like, I just don't think that the shape of it looks that good. And it was because on the model, it just looked a bit, I don't know, a bit something and nothing. So anyway, I was in store and I saw it and I was like, oh, the colour is amazing. And then I took it home and I tried it on. And actually, I think it is, as I said, it's just a case of really giving it like a big tie in the middle so you get like a nice waist sort of shape and then yeah the, the top then just sort of sits it's like really baggy and I just think it's such a nice dress to have for summer I love when dresses are this sort of like drapey shape because I feel like they're super flattering and you feel really comfortable in them so also on the blue satin dress vibe is this dress which is from charcoal clothing I'm just going to tilt this down so you can see see the full effect but I think this is so, so beautiful. I love the side split and obviously the cutout detail. It's so nice. And actually, this dress is unbelievably well priced. Like, it's such a... For the for the quality of the satin and, like, the style of the dress, obviously, it's, I feel like it's a very sort of occasion dress. Um, yeah, I just think if you've got, like, a birthday... I mean, you could also wear this to a wedding. I feel like possibly i've got slightly bigger boobs for this dress than maybe i'd wear to a wedding so i just don't want to be like hey <laughs> you know i'm not sure if it's a bit revealing but i feel like for like a birthday or you know like a, something like that i just think it would be so so nice the material just feels so so expensive i'm honestly so impressed with it um, and I just had to show you guys because I just think it's such a as I say it's such a lovely occasion dress I need I need to find a reason to wear this I don't know where but I will find an occasion to bring this one out. <laughs> okay, so first of all, with this outfit, I want to show you guys these Zara trousers that I got. I, I mean, I feel like <laughs> it's probably obvious why I picked these up. Maybe it has something to do with the fact that they're in the green. These are, like, I feel like they've become Instagram Zara trousers. I've seen them on so many different influences, and I absolutely love them. The length of them is so nice as well. They're um, just, like, a really nice length trouser. Um, so I'm wearing it here with a little pink bralette. This bralette is from Weekday. Actually, it's such a good little bralette. And I mean, I suppose it's probably like a little bit more of a bra, but I love wearing it under all of my blazers. I think it's such a good sort of shape and style. And it comes in other colors as well. But the blazer basically that went with these Zara trousers, I wasn't like a huge fan of. I wanted it to be like boxier. Um, and so I was annoyed because I wanted it as like the suit, but I didn't love the blazer anyway. When the Storette's blazers arrived, the green one, I was like, oh my god, it's actually a really close colour to the trousers. And I just feel like, because it's got 
the sort of structure and the boxy fit that I want out of the blazer. I was like, oh, perfect. So now I can wear it as a suit. And I just think, as I said, I, just, I mean, I'm obsessed with the fit of these blazers so much. So yeah, and I think with the little pop of pink underneath, it makes such a nice outfit. The only annoying thing about these trousers is I don't think I could get away with wearing heels with them because they are just a little bit too short for heels. I would probably have to find like a, a really small heel to wear this with. But I wanted to show you guys it anyway because I will find something to wear with them. I know I will. But I just wanted to show you as a suit with this blazer over the top. And of course, I wanted to share the little pink bralette with you because I think these bralettes are a must-have to wear underneath blazers at the moment. So as you can see, they're just like a really, they're like the perfect blazer bralette. So yeah, so weekday bras, they're the ones. And then lastly, I just wanted to show you two things. One, shameless plug, but the new SLA bodysuits are my favourite things and I wear them all the time. This is the Tibby bodysuit and I'm honestly in love with it. I just love the square neckline and like the super skinny straps. I just feel like it's really flattering on your shoulders and all that sort of stuff and not to toot SLA's trumpet too much, but the quality of this is amazing. Of course, it's SLA. It has to be amazing. Um, it's made out of like a really soft rib fabric um, that honestly just feels like you want to stroke yourself. They're so nice. There's also, we've got um, two new bodysuits. We've got this one and then there's their bodysuit online called the CC bodysuit. She's got slightly thicker straps and they're all made out of the same fabric. So yeah, I'm, I'm honestly in love with it. But then I also want to talk about these jeans, which are from Tommy Jeans. I got them from ASOS though. And I love the colour of these. These look so cute styled up with like just really simply. Again, I'm going to put on those black flip flops because they are just the best things ever. But I'll just put back on those sunglasses. These sunglasses, by the way, I know I've worn these a lot in my styling hauls, but I just think they give an outfit such a chic look. They're such a good pair of sunglasses if you want something that just sort of, as I say, just like chics up an outfit. Whenever I know that I want to look a bit expensive, I'll put these on. So like I never know how far to stand back from the camera. I always worry that my shoes are not in. I'm hoping they are. But I just think with coloured jeans, it's just such a nice way to wear denim in the summertime. And as you can see, these ones are so, so nice. And of course, I'm wearing the chunky mango flip-flops with these because they're are just the best things in the whole world with the sort of shoulder bag a really lovely sort of simple bodysuit they just work so well so there we go guys that is everything i have to show you in today's what's new in my wardrobe try on haul i honestly didn't mean for this to end up in such like a summer dress sort of vibe but it wasn't until i started trying everything on that i was like i've got a lot of dresses in this but i hope that you guys have found it useful especially if you've got any events coming up or you just really want some nice new summer dresses um i will of course as always i'll link all of the products below with the sizes that i'm wearing them in and all that sort of stuff please do give the video a thumbs up if you have enjoyed this one don't forget to subscribe and i will see you all in my next video bye guys